Okay, so we've all seen all them fidget prints that people can do on their 3D printers and the toys and the articulated dragons and all those fantastic things that we can do. But in today's video, I thought I would take the time to show you five functional, practical 3D prints that you can use in and outside of the home. If that's something you're interested in, then please stick around. So this plain deck card holder is very interesting um, obviously keeps your card nice and safe and the lid comes off like so you can also use that as a stand if you want um, you can turn it that way so this little piece here clips in there like so which gives you that sort of like extra raise there and then that sits quite nicely into the lid and also keeps your deck up off the table as well the thing about the thing I love about this is the fact that this is a self-writing mechanism that's been invented here. So you don't need to worry about, you know, getting your cards all nice and straight and stuff. You can just plop them in and it'll self self-write like so for you. Obviously, it's ideal for those that are on the go, those of us that are travelling. You might want to take a pair of set of cards on a plane with you or on a, on a, on a road trip. And it just keeps them all nice and organized in there. First useful print of the day. Quite happy with that. So yeah, this isn't the most exciting print. Um, but it's definitely very, very useful, especially for someone like me who doesn't have a hose pipe that self retracts. So, this will go quite nicely on the side of our house or on the actual side of the shed. I'm thinking about putting this, and obviously, I had to print this in something a little bit more rugged than your PLA and your PLA Plus. So, I have actually used the Elegoo ASA. Um, and it's in white and this was sent to me very kindly from Elegoo along with a few other different uh, filaments which I will speak about in another video but this actual ASA came out absolutely perfect and the thing about ASA is it's UV resistant and it's very tough it's very waterproof as well and it should go well in the garden so now I'm going to go away and attach this to the side of the shed and um, put the hose pipe on it and hopefully it should, but well, let's see. Okay, so this uh, print is a fantastic invention. It goes on top of your preferred drink, uh, like so. Clips on, uh, on a standard can. Nice and easy like that. And then, once you're obviously drinking your can and you put it down, especially in Britain, we get a lot of flies and stuff in the summer. You don't want them in there. You don't want any wasps or anything like that in there. So this is handy little thing that sits on there little umbrella and look at that fantastic and then just pop it open drink your drink and pop it back on again
So our next practical print is this. Now, can you guess what it is? It's something that's definitely needed by the 3D printing community, especially if you've got a couple of printers and a couple of build plates. Yes, that's right, this is a build plate holder. It's nothing amazing, but it's exactly what I require for my different build plates, especially the ones that I get sent in and I don't need to use on a regular basis. They can all just sit nicely in here. So as you can see, you can get four plates in this, which is exactly what I require. Um, nice and simple, nice and easy, and that will make my life a lot easier now when I'm trying to find where I put them build plates. So this is a heavy duty hanger that I printed off. Uh, I printed this with another filament that was sent to me by via Elegoo and that is their PLA carbon fiber. Obviously I used the carbon fiber filament because I wanted it to be nice and strong. I've got some heavy things that I need hanging and this is going to come in perfect for that. So yeah, it's just a simple bag hanger or something, you know. It ha goes on your, your hook like that, hooks on like that and you put your bag on like so. So there we have it, five practical 3D prints that you can print today and I'll obviously leave the links to the files themselves in the description below. I know that these prints aren't exactly fun but uh, they do actually serve a purpose and that's what I needed. I needed some prints to serve that purpose and it's amazing really what 3D printing can do. Um, if you have enjoyed the video, please leave me a thumbs up and, and comment on the video and let me know what you'd like to see in future episodes. Um, by all means, I love taking feedback on board. And uh, yeah, if you have enjoyed and you want to stick around uh, and join me on this journey of 3D printing, then please subscribe to the channel. Until next time, guys, I'll see you all later.